Let's get to just some breaking news. Houston police say a man who torched people's home then waited for them to come out so he could shoot them was recently notified that he was being evicted. Three people were killed before police shot and killed the suspect. People living in rooms on Dunlap near Holly in southwest Houston started calling 911 just after one this morning. ABC 13 Rosie reporter Rosie Wynn is there to tell us about how it all played out. Rosie. Erica and Micah, we spoke to the landlord of this multi-unit rental complex who respectfully asked to speak to us off camera. He estimates that there are about 10 units in this complex that are now completely uninhabitable. He says he spoke to the suspect who was allegedly behind this just yesterday. The tenant had lived here since 2013, but the landlord says he didn't pay rent and got evicted. HPD believes this may have been a retaliatory effort that was unleashed on his neighbors. Dispatch received multiple calls about a fire and a person down shortly after 1 o'clock this morning near the intersection of Holly and Dunlap. Investigators say the suspect shot at firefighters, forcing them to take cover, and it wasn't until an HPD officer arrived a short time later and confronted the shooter. They confirmed that the suspect died and tell us he was a black man in his 40s. Here's what Chief Troy Finner had to say about the incident earlier this morning. It's just, it's just sad what's going on in our nation. And, and I always ask for prayer, and I'm asking for prayer right now. All of these families, uh, can you imagine, and some of them probably hadn't been notified uh, just of yet, uh, it's occurring at 1 o'clock in the morning, but please pray. He says three additional people are dead, including two white men in their 60s and a black man in his 40s who died at the hospital. We're told there are two additional victims with injuries who survived. Investigators believe they were all residents living in the area. The landlord also tells us that one of the people killed this morning was his property manager who lived and worked here for 33 years. So a very heavy loss for the landlord and everyone who knew him in the neighborhood. The landlord is also looking for his dog who ran off from the fire scene this morning. His name is Duke and he is a German Shepherd. If you see him in the area, let us know. We would love to facilitate a reunion with the landlord who has been through so much as well as the people in the area. Reporting live from Southwest Houston, Rosie Wynn, ABC 13 Eyewitness News.